All right, we're gonna go through a quick tutorial of uh, Arcade 1-Ups, Mortal Kombat 2. It's a direct emulation of the arcade. I will show you some tips and tricks on how to uh, beat the AI, which some people consider to be extremely difficult, but once you get the patterns down, it's really not that bad. Uh, we will do it with... Uh, let's do it with Johnny Cage today. First two characters are very simple. You can just jump, kick, punch, do whatever you want for these two. Remember to block, but the uh, computer usually lets you win the first two pretty easily, <clears throat> as you can see. A couple patterns and stuff you're going to want to do. Uh, whenever you jump, kick, follow it up with a sweep. That usually works. Uh, test out some of your special moves against the uh, first two players if you want. They usually let you do it. So block, low punch, low kick, and then do an uppercut. Knock him to the ass. Pull, pull down on the controller and he'll cry. Second character. Pretty much the same thing. It's jump kick, block their specials. He goes invisible. It's not a big deal. You can do a lot of sweeping. All right, this is a pit fatality also. Every character's got a different way of doing it. Johnny Cage is down, 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 high kick. He's got this move. All right, down, 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 high kick. You hold down on both controllers, they'll slide off the spikes. <clears throat> now the AI starts to ramp right up. So the odds are they're going to hit you more than they sh more than you want them to, obviously. But you're not going to be able to pull off simple moves anymore and have them fall for it unless you get them to uh, to fall into your traps, basically. So the jacks, any character for that matter, you'll notice how he kind of hopped into me. He gets close to you, you jump back. A lot of the time he'll, uh, he'll try to get you as well. That opens up a free shot. There you go, down, down, forward, forward, low punch. No problem. All right, <clears throat> that is basically your move for the entire rest of the game. You have to know when to block, and if they don't fall for your little, uh, for your jump and bait move, then you kind of got to figure out other ways. But the odds are they will for the most part. You can always do an uppercut when they jump in. Lots of sweeps. Raiden, I like to knock his head off a couple times for the fatality because he has a hat on and I like seeing his head come off. So with Johnny Cage, I will do that. For those watching, again, just kind of look at the patterns that I'm doing here. So even jump kicking him sometimes, he'll give you an uppercut. Forward, forward, down, up, and hold block, low punch, and low kick, and down, and he'll knock off three heads. All right. Katana, I like Katana, we will do a friendship. So for a friendship, you can only use kick and block during the round. Uh, during the winning round. You can use punch in the first round if you want. If you block a projectile from close, you can usually sweep or do a roundhouse kick to her. I'm gonna turn it to a baby, actually. Back, 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 high kick. There you go. Nice snack for the uh, tree demons. <laughs> Liu Kang is going to do a lot of his bicycle kick. It's a 
start, usually you can just uh, block it to counter. If you try to jump at him, he'll throw a fireball at you. So don't. See? If they block a jump kick, usually they'll try to counter also. So just hold block. I will rip this guy in two. For a fatality. Down, down, forward, forward, low punch. There you go. Six wins. We're doing pretty good. We got another pit fatality here. So, again, every character is different. Johnny Cage is down, 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 high kick. Pretty simple. You just basically have to bait the character to jumping into you. It's the easiest way to do it. And then there's a number of many counters you can do. You can do his special uppercut. Basically do whatever you want. Down, 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 high kick. Molina is very simple. Basically, she will always try to throw her size at you. So if you time the kick perfectly, you'll notice that she falls right into your trap of the jump kick. Because she always tries to throw her size when you jump towards her. She sets up for an easy friendship or an easy babality. Uh, Johnny Cage's friendship is down four times and then high kick. See, we're already eight wins in, and the computer hasn't even phased me. Johnny Kick likes to start with a shadow kick sometimes. If he does, you just start the match off by ducking, and you can counter with an easy uppercut. He is fast. There you go. I usually like to do a friendship in front of Shao Kahn because it's embarrassing. However, I've already pushed punch this round, so I'm going to have to do something different. So I will just do a regular fatality. Or I could let him win this. Nah. Hmm. Okay, so I'll try a friendship again, or a Bay Valley. One more hit should do it. Babality. There you go, Shao Kahn. There's a child for you. The train. Kung Lao likes to start with his teleport, but if he doesn't, he will usually jump in. A lot of the time, when you get close to him, he'll throw his hat. Try to jump kick any blocks, so you should throw his hat. Alright, I'll knock this guy's head off. Oh. 
forward, forward, down, up. And you haven't noticed the pattern yet. Well, hopefully you notice it as I continue to play. Scorpion likes to start with a harpoon. If he does, you just block it. Counter with a shadow kick. I will knock him into the spikes. Actually, this is the level before the question mark. So, if you want to fight Jade, you got to win one round with just low kick. And actually, I think I pushed block already, so I'm going to let him beat me. <clears throat> I'm going to win the next round with just low kick. That's the only way you can fight Jade. See, you can't block, you can't punch, you can't do anything except push low kick in this round. Which... With this trick, it's fairly simple. However, it's not foolproof. Still takes a little bit of skill. <laughs> they don't always fall for the uh, jump there. Couldn't do a finishing move because I could only use low kick. There you go, there's Jade. Now Jade is very fast. She doesn't let you use any special moves on her. Um, fireballs, I believe, go right through her. So you basically just got to be quicker uh, than she is to win. So we will try our best. And she has Katana's moves. You can see she's very quick. Basically, you just gotta be quicker. See, she didn't kick my butt after the uh, after the win. Form of fatality. Three, three, to choose another character. Uh, I'll just stick with Johnny Cage because I'm already using him. Johnny Cage. <clears throat> We're almost at the uh, last two bosses. Fight. But once you figure out this pattern on uh, beating the computer, you can beat it on any difficulty level you want. The trick works for every difficulty difficulty and the computer falls for it with uh, 9 out of 12 the characters I believe Shang sounds pretty easy especially when he doesn't turn into anybody low punch. Alright, it's boss time. Kintaro uh, falls with a lot of jump kicks, basically. And you gotta time the jump kick properly, or he'll block it and destroy you. <clears throat> but that's 
tight speed up for him. And it looks easy. Trust me. It looks easy. But it is not that easy. So when he does do that jumping move where he teleports, if you jump back with kick, he'll usually get hit by it. Shao Kahn likes to shoulder charge a lot, block the shoulder charge, counter with a uh, shadow kick, and you can wipe them down pretty quick. A bunch of little jump kicks like this into them will uh, take a little bit of health off. character has a bit of a pattern too. It just comes down to blocking that shadow charge, shoulder charge, and counterattacking. And there you go. One man, Johnny Cage. Uh, it's pretty simple once you get the hang of it. I've been playing this game for 30 years, so I'd say I've mastered it. There you go. And yes, I'm real. I'm not the computer plan. So quick breakdown, first two characters will always be easy. You can just jump kick, do whatever moves you want. Uh, once the third player, uh, third opponent gets in, yes, the game gets a lot harder. Uh, you basically have to do the duck and jump trick to make your opponent jump in at you, and then it's do whatever you want to them. Uh, Kentaro, a lot of jump kicks, but it's got to be a deep jump kick. Otherwise, he'll hit you with an uppercut. Shao Kahn, basically, and every time you duck, he'll do a shoulder charge. For the most part, you block that shoulder charge, and you uh, counterattack. Anyways, that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Have a good day.